lifted up on the cross. He died. He rose again. Lifted up from the grave. He ascended. So will you ascend. So will you ascend. You will climb that height. You will climb your mountain. As I keep thinking, I want you to pray this prayer with me. Let praises rise from the ashes. Whatever may appear apparently like a grave like situation. It may be sickness. It may be like nothing. I want you to prophesy. Speak to that situation. Now, nobody else is going to do it for you. I want you to take charge. I want you to speak to that situation this morning. The word of God has been released. Speak to that situation. Speak to that condition. Whatever that thing is, I want you to speak. Speak. Don't close your mouth. Remember, our father told us, you can't shut your mouth. You can't be tied up. Your feet can't be tied down. You can't be isolated. You don't speak. Speak to that situation. Speak to that mountain. Speak to that condition. Maybe you've been successful before, but you're expecting greater success. Speak the word. Just like the word was spoken to the man at the beautiful gate. Silver and gold I do not have, but such as I have I say unto you. Speak to that condition. Maybe everything else has been failing you. Maybe everyone has been failing you. Maybe nothing seems to have been working. Maybe your certificates are not even working. Maybe your career has met a roadblock. Speak to that situation here today. Speak the word of God. Speak by faith. Speak believing. Maybe it's your family. You're expecting more from your children. Or you're expecting more from your family. Or you're expecting more from your career. Or you're expecting more from your ministry. Now speak the word. Speak the word. Speak the word. The word comes with power. The word is a declaration that God is able, that God can do all things. The Bible tells us, for with God, nothing shall be possible. Speak to the situation here today. You have a license. You have the authority. Whatever you decree on earth will be done, sanctioned, established in heaven. Speak the word. Speak the word. Young people, speak the word. Your future is at stake. Speak the word. Your family is at stake. Speak the word. Speak the word. Speak the word. Speak into the life of your children. Speak into that condition. Speak concerning your spouse. Speak concerning your career. Speak the word. You are not meant to be on the valley. You are not meant to be on the dumping ground. I am not going to be a dumping ground. Speak the word. Speak the word. The Lord said you'll be the head and not the tail. Speak the word. He said above only and not beneath. Speak the word. There will be a manifestation. Manifestation. I want you to say manifestation. Manifestation in my life, in my family. Manifestation. Speak the word. The word has been spoken. Manifestation concerning my career. Manifestation concerning my family. Manifestation. Speak the word. We're not here for fun. We're not here to see people. We're not here to just socialization. We're here to change destiny. We're here to move forward. We're here for progress. Speak the word. Speak the word. Speak the word. What are you trusting God for? Call it into being. Call it into life. Call it into action. Speak the word. Speak the word. And speak in the name of Jesus. The devil respects the name of Jesus. The devil respects a, a child of God, identity with Christ. I want you to say, I come in the name of the Lord. I come in the name of Jesus. I come in the name of the Lord. I come in the name of Jesus. I come as a representative. Remember our Father told us, if you're an ambassador of Christ, much is expected from you. An ambassador, not in isolation. You're going to have to represent the kingdom of, of heaven. You're going to have to represent the kingdom of life. You're going to have to represent. There's something about darkness. When you put light where there's darkness, darkness gives way. You're going to say, I represent light. I am the salt of the earth. I, would, I have not lost my savour. I carry the presence of God. I carry the life of God. I carry the spirit of God. The Bible 
Bible says, as many have received him, he gave them power to become the sons of God. I carry the Spirit of God. I carry the Holy Spirit. I'm a carrier of life. I'm a carrier of life. I'm a carrier of the Word. I'm a carrier of the host of heaven. From the inside, from the inside, unfortunately, the world is dumping things on us. The world is dumping things on us. And we're going to say, regardless of what the world is doing, now, from the inside, I will begin to give life. I will not be a recipient of death. I give life, abundant life. I give light. I give song. I give taste. Let praises rise. Let praises rise. From the inside, from the inside, from the spirit man, from the spirit man, from the spirit woman, let praises rise, let it rise, let the beauty of the Christ rise from the inside, from the inside, from today, I begin to make impact, impact, manifestation, impact, life, substance, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, let it rise. From the inside. From the inside. Of me. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Do you understand who you are in Christ? Do you understand the God that you serve? You serve a living God. Can I even say a living God? You serve a mighty God. Can I hear everybody say mighty God? Can, you, can I hear say an incredible God? A covenant keeping God. A gracious God. A forgiving God. A loving God. That those attributes will be translated into your life in Jesus' name. Can I hear everybody shout Amen? Can I hear everybody shout Amen? Amen. We're waking up. Praise God. Amen. Please be seated for a moment before, uh, you know, I told you at the beginning, and I want to thank God for the life that is in the house here. I want to thank God because of the energy that is in the house here. Uh, he told us before the message that uh, the senior pastor of this church, who has been at the mission field, Pastor Michael Dada, will be addressing us, will be speaking not just to us, but the entire region of the church. He has a message for us before we leave. Uh, some of you missed a lot. He was here as far back as uh, two days ago. I know as you were coming in, you saw his car there. Uh, you thought he was around. But at the moment you see him here, and the next moment he's all gone. Uh, but he's here with us in the spirit. Amen. And he'll be connecting with us virtually uh, life as I give way. And I believe the media...